Hey guys. How's it going guys? All good? Okay, everything okay. All right, great. Good to see ya. How's everything, uh, Francisco? Uh, today, my, it was my breakfast, and that's why uh, I feel a little bit fresh, uh, but I had an infection yesterday in my ear. And I went to uh, an appointment with the doctor. Okay. Your microphone is kind of messaged uh, right now. I, I could barely understand what, uh, what you were saying because of that. Um, but anyways, uh, I'm glad to have you here, Frank. Uh, what about you, Adrian? How's it going? Adrian? I think your microphone is not working. Nori, how's it going? How's everything today, Hello? Nori? Hello, teacher. Hello. How's everything? Hello. Everything Hi. is okay. Everything good? And you? It's good. It's good, you know. Tired. Are you tired. tired? Yeah, I'm tired. Yeah, but uh, I'm okay. You know, I'm always, I mean, I'm, 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 I'm just like normally tired, you know. <laughs> All right, guys, so let's get started, okay? The same to me. Yeah, it's just that I, I just finished working out. So I, I'm working out every day. I haven't lost any weight, but I've gotten, you know, um, I feel stronger. And the other thing is that I, um, I, you know, I built up some muscle. So that's a good thing. Me too, teacher. You I too? have to go for a walk when oh, nice. I finish the class. Nice, nice. So you will go for a walk every time you finish the class? Oh, nice. Really? Every, every day? Every nice. day. That's nice. That's nice. The only the only days I, I rest are the, on, on weekends, you know, but every other day I, I do exercise. But that's great. That's great. Welcome, Marcos. Nice to see you. Adrian, nice to see you. Hello, everyone. Hilda, nice to see you. Hilda. Hello, hello. All right. And uh, Haiti, nice to see you, too. All right, guys. So, so let's get us started, guys. All right, so yesterday, guys, we were talking about comparing adjectives, you know. Now we're going to talk about comparing nouns, guys, and I have some exercises for you, okay? So what is the difference between comparing adjectives and comparing nouns? There's only one difference, guys, okay? Think about, do you remember, guys, what happens when we compare long adjectives? We use more. Okay, very good. You use more, right? What if and you compare... Then. What if you compare more than three things? You know, three or more things. What What do you What do you use? Superlative. Superlative. Superlatives. Okay. Very good. What if it is a a, a long superlative? What do you use? The most. The most. Very good. What if it is you know less than less than uh, less than oh. two. I mean two syllables or less. You know, if it is a small. Adjective, all right, you use ER for comparatives, right? What about superlatives? What do you use for superlatives? EST. All right, you use EST. Very good, man. All right, great, great job, Adrian. You deserve an applause, okay? Applause. Everybody. <laughs> All right, very good. All right, that, that is great, guys, okay? So think about it like this, okay? So what we were saying, guys, is that when we have long adjectives, We have, this is what happens, okay? All right, you add, for comparatives, you add, um, you add um, ER, right? I mean, if it is, if it is, I mean, I mean, a long, uh, long adjectives, guys, for comparatives, you are, you, you add uh, more or less, right? And for superlatives, Right. Superlatives, you add, what do you add, guys? 
you add the most, right? The most or you add the least. Got it? All right. So for example, all right, who would like to give me a sentence, guys, using a superlative? Give me a long adjective, guys. Okay, let's let's compare, guys. All right, let's use a superlative, right? Uh, using long adjectives. Important. Important. Okay, right. But but a whole sentence. Okay, I want to talk about a whole sentence. Um. <clears throat> family is the most important thing in life. Family. Okay, family is the most important thing in life okay very good i like this example right family is the most important thing in life all right now uh here guys where's the adjective where's the adjective family family no, the adjective guys the adjective is important okay very good important. right it's important okay pretty good now so this is where we are comparing adjectives okay right now give me an example guys of comparing um now using comparatives guys give me a long adjective okay let's compare a long adjective uh haiti give me one example haiti is the mastery is the most important for your life you remember comparative okay um comparative comparatives are used for two things only we're comparing two things okay 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 so all right so give me another example if you will let's have an adjective guys give me an adjective expensive expensive okay all right, so let's, uh, Haiti, give me give me a sentence comparing expensive. I, I don't know, let's talk about things that you would like to buy or something, you know? You're Can muted. Be, uh, the car. Okay, so let's compare a car to- The car. Uh-huh. A car. The car is, a car is more expensive. Expensive, okay. Mm -hmm. Than a then, pencil. Than a pencil. Okay, good job. Okay, a car is more expensive than a pencil. What? Where is the adjective here, guys? Where do we have the adjective? Expensive. Okay, the adjective is expensive. Okay, so this is why we are comparing adjectives, guys. Okay, all right. So this is comparing adjectives. So in the example that we have in the presentation, guys. Right. So in this example right here. We are no longer comparing adjectives. We are comparing. Nouns. We're comparing nouns, okay? And what is a noun, guys? Take a look at this, okay? All right. So let's read the first example. Let's have Ricardo. Welcome, Ricardo. Could you please help me read? Uh, yeah. Well, <laughs> good night. Um, comparing nouns, um, two things. Edward has more video games than George does. Very good. Good job. All right. Keep it there. Okay. Thank you. Thanks a lot. So here, guys, notice, okay, do we have an adjective here? Do we have an adjective in this sentence? Yes or no? No. Yes. Where, whoever said yes, where do we have the adjective? We don't have an adjective here, guys, okay? because we are not comparing qualities, okay? We're not comparing qualities, okay? We're no longer comparing we're comparing quality, guys. What are we comparing here? We are comparing? Quantities. Nouns. We're comparing nouns, there you go, okay? We're comparing nouns, guys, okay? Got it? So this is not an adjective, okay? So what is the difference, guys, okay? The difference is that well, two things, okay? Take a look at, let's let's play with the first example, all right? Let's go back to the drawing board. So here, guys, okay, we are using, guys, the verb be, right? 
Got it? Reason the verb be here. Okay. So if we want to compare nouns, all right, we're going to use have. Okay. So for example, you can say, um, let's see. I don't know. Um, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Adrian. All right, Adrian. Do you have do you have a brother or sister? Do you have siblings? I have a sister. Okay. Who has more money? You or your sister? Mm. Who makes more money? Mm, maybe my sister. Maybe your sister? More money than me. Okay, right. So you can see now here guys, you can use other verbs, right? But let's use half, okay? So you can say my sister, right? Or Adrian's sister has, has or have guys? Have. Has, right? Okay? Has, mm. all right. And we're gonna use, we're gonna treat this as if there were long adjectives, okay? Right? You're gonna treat them as if there were long adjectives. So what do we do with long adjectives guys? What do we add? More. Most more, more, okay, more money, right, than his sister, all right, very good. So now here, guys, no, no, it, it's not okay. It, it's not okay to what? I'm sorry. Adrian's, Adrian's sister has more money than him. No. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Hold on, Adrian's sister has more money than yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, uh, yes. So it's like this, guys. Adrian's, hold on. Adrian's sister, sister. Well, hold on, no. Adrian has, let's go with less, okay? Less money. I mean, you can say like that, Ernesto, okay? But just for the sake of using has, okay? I wanna, I wanna do it like this, okay? You can say Adrian has less money than his sister. Right, sister. or you can say, you know, his sister has more money than him or than Adrian. Got it? All right, so you can do it like this as well. Or you could say, you know, if you want to use possessives, right? Adrian's sister has more money than him. All right, this is they all mean the same, guys. Okay, todo significa absolutamente lo mismo. Got it? All right. So very good. So what do you notice here, guys? Okay, we're using another verb. We're not using is anymore. So we're using have, right? And we're using, see? We're using, guys, what we use when we're comparing, you know, uh, com when we're using, uh, when we're comparing two long adjectives, okay? All right, now, you guys give me another example. Let's see. Do my favorite, guys. Everybody send me one example comparing two nouns, okay? Let's compare two nouns. And welcome everybody else who just joined, who just joined. All right. So everybody, guys, in the chat, send me one example, just one example, okay? And remember to turn on your cameras, guys. Singrid, Herbert, Frank, Rodrigo, Tati, Jenny, welcome. Nice to see you. All right. So, uh, all right. So uh, let's send me one example, guys. Meanwhile, I'm going to ask you, all right, um, so Rodrigo Gonzalez, okay, Rodrigo, would you please be so kind to give me one example? Go ahead. I think, I'm not sure if your microphone is not working. All right, let's see. All right, David Hernandez, give me your example. Messi has more cups than Cristiano Ronaldo. Who, I'm sorry? Cristiano Ronaldo. Okay, oh, Messi has more cups. <laughs> okay. Messi has more, you mean World, world Cups, right? Uh, no, cups only. 
World Cup Zero. Both. Okay. Both them. Uh -huh. Those are called trophies. Ah, okay. Trophies. Okay. Then CR. Okay, whatever. All right. All right. So Messi has more trophies than Dan, right? Cristiano CR7. Ronaldo. Forget. <laughs> Is this the as CR7 again? CR7. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, all right. Let's call it a little bit like that. Okay. Very good. Um, so let's see, guys. Uh, we have another example here. Francisco, because of I am eating. Okay, that is incorrect. Um, Ricardo, Jens Benzos, you mean Jeff Bezos, has more money than Elon Musk. Okay, very good. Jens Be Benzos. <laughs> uh, Ernesto Puñate, my brother is more intelligent than my... Now, Ernesto, what you're comparing there is, I mean, that is correct. However, guys, you need to use, um, we're comparing nouns, not adjectives. What you're comparing there, Ernesto, that's an adjective, okay? You need to compare nouns, not adjectives, okay? We're not comparing adjectives anymore. Got it, Ernesto? Ernesto? Okay, I will try a new one. Okay, nouns, okay, all right? Nouns, not adjectives, thank you. My daughter is more pretty now. Uh, Maria Belen, same thing. First of all, it's prettier, not more pretty, right? Remember, short adjective. Secondly, we're not comparing adjectives. We're comparing nouns, all right? Guys, connect this temprano para que no se pierda lo primero que les empiezo a, a, a enseñar de grammar, okay? All right, estamos comparando sustantivos. No, no estamos comparando adjetivos anymore, okay? All right, so uh, Francisco, Belta is more... Oh, hungry than Pablo. Okay, now that is an adjective, and it's not hungry. It's hungrier. Okay, remember short adjectives. I have more patience than you. Very good, Oscar. Um, my brother has more hair than me. Haiti, your brother has more hair than you. Really? All right, but that's a good example, Haiti. I have more patience than my brother. Okay. BMW is more expensive than Toyota. Now, mailing more expensive is not a noun. Okay, the the the, the sentence is correct, but that is not a noun. We need that to compare adjectives, guys. All right, Nuri Devaye, my sister drinks more coffee than me. Very good, that is correct, Nuri. Adrian, the book I am reading is more interesting than the one you are reading. Now that the sentence is correct, Adrian. But we are comparing nouns. Uh, we're comparing nouns. Guys, you're forgetting something here, right? A lot of you are making mistakes here because, actually, guys, the reason you're making mistakes is because you came late, right? Guys, what David, is a noun? Tell me. I need to back the presentation. I need to screenshot. Okay, hold on. There you go. Got it? No. Not yet. All right, very good. That's okay. I got it. Very good. Thank you. All right. Very good, guys. Thanks. So let me ask you. So, well, let me ask you this, guys. All right. Because we need to move on, guys. Okay. What is a noun, guys? I have two questions for you. What is a noun and what is an adjective? Okay. If you don't understand this, guys, we're not gonna move on. What is the difference between them two? First of all, what is a noun? Let's see, Maria Belen, what is a noun? A noun, uh, whatever, um, um, for example, I. I is a pronoun, not a noun. That is a pronoun. What is a noun, guys? A noun is the word that you use for refer uh, animal, person, object specifically. Very good. Okay, right. It's I like that explanation. It's a word to refer to you know to an animal, object, people, etc. Okay, objects. Okay, whatever. All right. So for example, guys, when we say money, is this a noun? Yes. Right? Yes. When we say uh, Alexa, is that a noun? 
No, that's a subject, right? Yeah. That's a noun, guys. Yes, right? What if we say dog? Is that a noun? Yes. Yes. U universe, is that a noun? Yes. Guys, all right, very good. Thank you. Guys, a noun is, you know, whatever or whoever we are talking about, okay? This is a noun. Write it down, guys, okay? Guys, write it down. Write it down in your notebook, guys, because you're making, a lot of you are making mistakes here, okay? I needed to understand what the difference is. All right, Marcos, give me an example of a noun, sir. A noun? Yes. Beer. Beer, okay, very good. Okay, beer is a noun, all right? Very good. Now, let me ask you something. Is this a noun, guys? Is this a noun? No, that's a noun. No. No, no right? Good. Very good. What if what if my name, guys, if what if my name is beautiful? I am teacher beautiful. <laughs> beautiful I is like see it in another in another country. This uh, really okay. I didn't know. So guys, what if my name is beautiful? Beautiful is beautiful. Is this a is no. this an is this an adjective? No. Name. No, in this case, guys, this is not an adjective, okay? This is working as a noun. And this is an adjective. Why? Because an adjective, guys, what is an adjective? You should know this already. ¿Qué es un adjetivo? ¿Qué es un adjetivo? Describe a subject. It describes the noun, guys, not the subject. Guys, oh, es que se les olvida una cosa. Un sujeto, guys, un subject, okay? The subject can be a noun or a pronoun. Okay? Yo me decís noun, yo ya sé que puede ser un sujeto o un objeto de la oración. Got it? You cannot forget this, okay? The subject can be either this or this, guys, okay? So it's incorrect to say the subject because it could also modify objects, you know? And an object can also be a, a pronoun and a pronoun. Got it? All right? So very good, guys. So when I what I'm telling you guys is, hey, let's compare nouns, okay? So when you do this, guys, he is more, uh, let's see, he's more intelligent, right? Than, than her, right? Am I comparing a noun here? Estoy comparando un, un, un sustantivo aquí, sí o no? No. 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 I know, right? I am comparing what? An adjective. An adjective. Right, I am comparing an adjective. So how can I compare a noun? Has more. He has more what? Intelligence. No. Money. He has more money, right? Or more cars or more whatever, guys. Okay. He has more. Uh, I do score. He has, he has a, a more. Muscle. He, no, he has more muscles. No. Because <laughs> that's I mean, the, the way you would say that that's okay. He has more. Cars, all right, let's go with cars. He has more cars than me, all right? Very good. So here, guys, notice, what am I comparing? Is cars an adjective? Is this an adjective? No, mm -hmm. right? It is a noun. So see, guys, this is what I want you to compare in your examples. Esos son los ejemplos que quiero. No quiero, guys. I don't want this. I don't want adjectives, okay? No adjectives, okay? Okay, I want nouns okay this is what i want you to send me okay got it so what are you gonna do guys okay first of all you're not gonna use the verb be anymore okay you can use other verbs okay so you can say he has or she has you know or i have or eduardo has you know whatever but you can also say you know he he um he bought you know he bought more cars than me for example right all right, el compro más carros que yo. Got it? So you can use verbs that are relevant to what we are, you know, what we are comparing, all right? So do me a favor, guys. Everybody who sent me examples, all right? Actually, everybody, guys, send me another example, okay? Send me another example comparing nouns. Okay, I want nouns right now, guys. Okay, please. All right, so let's see your new examples. All right, all right. Let 
meanwhile, I'm going to ask. So my participants are going to be the people with the cameras turned off. Okay. Herbert. Hello, Herbert. Could you please give me your example, Herbert? Very good. Let's have. Okay, okay. All right, let's go. I here. got my example. Go uh, my friends uh, has less English vocabulary than my, than my sister. Beautiful, okay. I like that. So, my friend has less uh, English vocabulary than my sister, right? Good example, thank you. All right, I like that. Very good. Uh, Marcos Escobar, give me your example. Um, Pedro eats more pizza than Jose. All right, Pedro eats more, more pizza than Jose. Very good. Uh, David, give me your example. Paula drank more water than Chepe. Paula drank drink right more water than chepe very good let's see hilda give me your example hilda the teacher and then i problem with my micro that's okay oh, okay um, um my son uh, my son um Let's go with it. Uh, it's uh, more, uh -huh. more, how do you say pan dulce? <laughs> bread, sweet, sweet. Sweet bread, okay. Than my daughter. Than my daughter, okay, good job, okay. Mm -hmm. Beautiful, guys, beautiful. Uh, Tatiana, mm -hmm. give me your example, please. Uh, the computer is bigger than laptop. The computer is, is what? Bigger. But bigger is an, an adjective. Oh. Yes, you can say the computer, right? Or that computer, right? That computer has more viruses than the laptop. See? Now you're saying more viruses, right? This is a noun now, okay, not an adjective. Okay, so this is this is this one. All right, guys. So now, very good, guys. Okay, now, uh, now what about superlatives, guys? How do we use superlatives, you know, with nouns? Same thing, guys. Okay, so talking about superlatives, remember, guys, just use them as long adjectives. So you can say, my brother has. Um, let's see. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Has the most video games in school, all right? So if you wanna compare guys, okay? Now, if, if you're talking about superlatives, remember guys, this is three or more things, right? But again, guys, video games, is that an adjective? Is this an adjective, video games? No. Oh, no, no, right? No. It is a noun, exactly. So, the same thing, guys. Instead of saying, you know, is, you're going to use has or any other verb, okay? So, this basically what it says, guys. Mi hermano es el que tiene más videojuegos en la escuela. Got it? But that's how you say it. My brother has the most video games in school. Or owns. You can say owns if you want to change the verb. Pose, owns, okay? <clears throat> right? Uh, let's have another example. You guys give me another example, okay? Uh, Oscar, give me one example. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> mm, let's, talk I don't about, know. let's talk about, um, just follow the structure, right? Follow the structure. First of all, who are you going to talk about? Choose someone, mm -hmm. right? Pick someone to talk about. Your brother, yourself. My sister. All right, my sister. Okay, right. Very good. So my sister. Now, talk about what is one thing that, you know, she has 
the most compared to everybody else? Mm. I don't know. I don't have any idea. All right, help him, guys. My sister, what? <laughs> David. My sister, uh, boat. Um, but, not boat. Boat, boat is uh -huh. barco, but, uh huh? But the, the most expensive, the, uh, the most. No. Don't say expensive, guys, because expensive no. is an adjective. Uh, the most fly. The most what? Fly. Vuelo. Flight. Oh. Okay. <laughs> no, the, no, no. Okay, no. so my sister bought the most. Uh, you can no. say. Dresses. The most tickets. Uh, okay. All right. So my sister bought the most, uh, you can say, flight tickets, okay? All right, so see you guys. So now this is a noun, see? My sister bought the most flight tickets. Es la que compró la mayoría, es like, like saying la mayoría de vuelos de via, de ticket de vuelo, got it? So guys, it is the same thing as comparing, you know, with superlatives. The only difference is you are going to use nouns, okay? Vas a usar nouns y vas a cambiar el verbo is. Got it? That is the only difference, okay? Remember, you can say, you know, uh, Maria, is the smartest, right? Maria is la más inteligente, right? That, that's an example, right? However, this is, guys, instead of saying, instead of doing this, what we're going to do, guys, we're going to substitute two things here, okay? What are the two things that we're going to substitute? ¿Cuáles son las dos cosas que vamos a sustituir aquí, guys? Is. Is. And what else? Smartest. Okay, so we're going to substitute is and also the adjective, okay? So we're not going to use this and we're not going to use smartest, okay? So, vamos a sustituir esas dos cosas, okay? So how can we substitute them? Maria has. Maria, very good, okay, Maria. So, so we're going to do this, okay? All right, so I'm going to, Maria. All right, Maria. And then we're going to say here, has, very good. The most expensive car. Guys, if you say the most expensive, Expensive is a, is it that a noun? No. You no, know, right? So no. Maria has the most. The most is smart. The most what? Smart? Intelligent? Guys, Knowledge. No adjectives, guys. They have to say adjectives, okay? All right. Knowledge. The most, okay. The most knowledge, okay? Very good. I like that, okay? Maria is la que tiene. El mayor conocimiento, right? Got it? Let's change, okay? Let's change this, okay? Maria has the most what? Give me another noun. Give me another noun. Just give me a noun, guys. The most new cell phone. Okay, now, if you say new is an adjective, <laughs> and that would be correct because you would need to say newest, okay? Guys, stop giving me adjectives. Funny. <laughs> That's an adjective. <laughs> uh, popular <laughs> hairstyle. Okay, the most hairstyle. Now, you cannot say the most hairstyle because that is not something that you can count, okay? All right? You have to use something that you can count. Tienes que usar algo que puedes contar, okay? The most dolls. The most dolls. Very good, okay? Maria tiene la mayoría de muñecas, okay? All right? The most what? Shoes. The most what? Shoes. The most shoes, okay? Very good. Okay? Very good. What else? Uh, the most freckles. Somebody said freckles, right? Very good. Uh, what else, guys? What else? Homework. The most homework. Homework? All right. Uh, you can say, you can say, for example, the, the, the most, most high heels. Okay, the most high. Now, if you say the most high heels, guys, you need to count, okay? Tiene que ser un noun, guys. It has to be a noun that you can count, okay? It has to be countable. Got it? If you say the most high heels, this is basically telling me that you have, basically, if you say Maria has the most high heels, you have like one high heel, two high heels, three high heels, 
four, five, six, seven, et cetera. Got it? And maybe you're talking about the high, the you know, the tallest high heel, right? So guys, this refers to quantity, okay? Restaurants. Right. Very good. You can say restaurants, exactly, okay? All right. The most restaurants. See? Earring. The most earrings, okay? Very Scarf. good, okay. Uh, the most what? Scarf. Scarves, okay. The most scarves, okay. What else? Sandals. Sandals, very good, okay. Good job, right? What else? Flip-flops. Flip-flops, okay, very good. Now you're understanding, guys. Flip-flops, okay, very good. What else? Tres. Cell phones. Cell phones, okay, very good. Okay, all right, got it, guys? All right, do you get it now? Do we do we all understand now? Yes, no? Yes. Okay, all right. So it's easy, right? Okay. So you're getting confused, guys, because you're trying you're trying to translate. Your brain is like, oh my god, okay, like the most no, don't do not try to translate, guys, okay? This is referring to quantity, all right, to quantity of something, okay? Like, ¿cómo decís, guys, que yo soy el que tengo la mayoría de pelotas? How do you say that? How will you translate that? Oh, David has the most balls, you know, all right? Or the most amount uh, of balls, okay, all right? So that's how you would say this, all right? So now, guys, we need to move on, okay? So I have an exercise for you. Uh, let's take a screenshot. Uh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you guys. So <clears throat> what you're gonna do here, guys, read this, okay? And you're gonna complete it with, you know, comparatives, okay? But this is comparing nouns, okay? Now this is comparing nouns, guys, okay? So it says at one point, New York City had about 140 sk uh, skyscrapers. Chicago, Chicago had about, uh, had about 68. And Houston had about 36. So Houston had? The list. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now, before, before, we, before we continue with this, guys, okay, there is another thing that I forgot to tell you, okay? If it is, guys, all right, if you're talking about the opposite of most, guys, that would be the fewest, okay? Write it down. The fewest, okay? That means that, you know, the least amount. Okay, significa la minoría, guys, okay? En vez de la mayoría, esto es la minoría, the fewest, okay? The fewest mistakes on the test, okay? All right, very good. So think about this, guys. So uh, Houston had 36 versus 140 versus 68. So, okay, Houston had the? Fewest. Fewest, okay? The fewest skyscrape, uh, skyscrapes of all these cities. Got it? So you're gonna do guys the same with everything else, okay? So you either you're either gonna use the most or the fewest, okay? Got it? All right, very good. So I'm gonna take a screenshot, guys, okay? And uh, you're gonna do the same thing with everything else, okay? All right. So I'm gonna send the screenshot to the WhatsApp group right now, guys. There is number one, and I'm sending number two, too. All right. So let's work in couples, guys. Hello, Tati. Uh, oh, Jenny has two devices, I think. Hold on. How are you, Tati? Everything good? Hello. See you. Hold on. I'm going to get Ilda here with you. Oh, never mind. Hold on, Ernesto. Oh. 
Jenny, Jenny, Jenny. All right. So Ernest is going to come here, okay? Okay. Jenny. Actually, we're going to go to, oh, there you go. Hello, Ernesto. All right, so do we understand what we're going to do? You're muted, Ernesto. That did, do we understand what we're, what we're going to do? Okay, very good. Number three. Mouse. No, more. More. Pedro has more medals than Enrique. Okay, the fourth. Uh -huh. Okay, Pedro. Pedro has more medals than Enrique. More, more, more. medals than Enrique. It's correct, teacher. Yes, yes, that is correct. More. Okay. Maybe more or maybe less. It's right. Yeah, you can say less medals or more medals. It depends. Take a look. Take a look at the picture. I guess I don't know what it says. Uh, what picture? Pedro has more. Yeah, I you don't can have say more. Picture. No, never mind. Never mind. Because yeah, yeah, you can say more or less. Yes. Yeah, That's but it's better, I, more. it's better. I more. only see some building. Okay. Yeah. No. No. I understand. I understand. Don't worry. But yeah, ah, okay. you can use both. Whatever you. Ah. Want. Okay. The number. Mond mm, number four. Mandarin Chinese had about uh, 500, five five, 500 million. Mm -hmm. Mandarin Chinese bigger than English. Mandarin Chinese has about 5 million. 500 million, teacher, is okay, is, uh, is right? Uh, which one? Uh, 500 million. I mean, which one are you reading? Which which exercise? Ah, the number four. Okay. Uh, yeah, 500 million. Yeah. It has, uh, Mandarin okay. Chinese has about 5 million. 500 million. 500. 500, 500 million. Yes. Mandarin Chinese. Native speaker than native, English. Native. 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 Yes. Yes. Good uh, job, girls. Export about by new. Everything good here, guys? And yeah. sure, uh, all of them, we, we can just choose between the most or the fewest. We cannot say more. No, you can say more. Yes. It, it's If, if you yeah. are comparing two things, it has to be more or less. Okay. Like number yeah. six, Mar has two moons. It has more moons than. Neptune, exactly. which has 13. Ah, yes. Okay. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Right. Yeah. Hey, guys. Few. Any question here? Few. Remember that you can use you can use more and you can use less too, right? If it is, if you're comparing two things. More and? More or less. More, more or less. Less. less right? Yes. Or well, fewer. You can also Few. use fewer. 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 Yes, fewer. All right. If it is two things, right? If it is more, then you know what to use. All right. Thanks. Hey guys, remember that that if you're if you're not if you're not comparing more than three things, you have oh, three or more things, you know, you have to use more or you have to use less or fewer. Okay. All right. Fewer. This option use fewer and less. Yeah. You can use fewer moons, for example, or less moons. Ah, okay. But for the superlative, is obligation to use the fewest. Yeah, mm -hmm. exactly. Okay. 
So in okay. this case. Okay. Hi. And has fewer. Mars has mm -hmm. few, fewer. Remember, guys, remember that if you're comparing two things, guys, you can use, you know, more, you can use fewer, right? Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, 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 I, okay, I think we are. It has fewer moons than Neptune, which has thirteen. I guess remember that if you're using, you know, if you're comparing two things, you can use more. You can use fewer. Okay. Yes. What? Well, okay. In this one, it says the Spanish word with with uh, letter is electroencephalographistas. It has 24 letters and is a type of medical worker. Okay. What is your uh, question? Uh, no, this one has 24 letters. What are you talking about? Uh, uh, I don't know how to make the, this one. The Spanish word with a less, uh, the most, ah, this one is most. The most letters is electroencephalographistas. It has 24 letters and it is, it is a type. All right, guys, remember more. that if you're only comparing two things, you can use more or fewer, okay? Only more or fewer. Yes, or you can use less too, right? Okay. Nine million. Two so the of Spanish rice. word, the Spanish word with uh, more. More letters. Mm -hmm. More letters. Electron phallographistas. It has 24 letters and is a type of medical worker. The line spore about 9 million stews of rice a, a year. Viet Vietnam spores about 4. 0.6 million tooth and India sports about 4.5 million tooths. Timeline, timeline exports more rice, more, more rice. Uh -huh. Oh, more rice or the most? The most rice. Or the teacher say uh -huh. more. We so use guys, more. So so if it is two things, right? You you're you're gonna use either the more most. or least or, or less, I'm sorry. Or you're gonna use no guys, two things. I'm right, pay attention. Two things, guys. If it is two things, you're gonna use more or less, mm -hmm. or you're gonna use fewer, right? Mm -hmm. All right. If it is more than if it is three or more, you're gonna use the most or you're gonna the use mm -hmm. yeah, or the least or the fewest, okay. Right. The most, mm -hmm. the most, the most, the most rice, uh huh. The most rice of the three. The most. All right, we need to go back now, guys. Okay. Okay. Welcome back. Hey guys, um, real quick. Okay, so in the example, guys. All right, so we had an we had an example, right? Uh, you guys, I, I I heard your answers, guys. They were pretty good, actually. Okay, uh, not many of you had issues understanding this part. However, guys, I want you to understand something here. Okay, so guys. Some of you were asking me, you know, uh, can we use less, you know? Yes, guys, you can use less or you can use fewer, 
right? What is the difference between less and fewer, guys? There is one difference, okay? So for uncountable nouns, you use less, okay? And I'm talking about, guys, comparing nouns, okay? I'm talking about comparing nouns, okay? So for uncountable nouns, you use less, all right? For countable nouns, you use fewer. All right, and I'm talking about plural, okay? Plural countable nouns, right? You use fewer. For example, guys, you can say, you know, uh, um, you can say he has the, um, he has less milk than me, all right? Milk, guys, is it countable or uncountable? Uncountable. Uncountable, right? Because you cannot say milks, right? No puede decir leches, right? So this is uncountable. Right? Now, you can say, you know, he has, uh, he has uh, fewer cars. Okay? Why fewer? Because is, is cars countable or uncountable, guys? Countable. Uncountable. This is countable, right? All right. So that's it. Okay. All right. So that that's that's the only thing, guys, that you have to remember there. Okay. So the answer for number one, we already know, guys. We already went through that. Uh, what's the answer for number two? Ashurita Foreman holds many world records, such as jumping the longest distance on a pogo stick. On a pogo stick. In fact, he holds the most. You know, all right, the most Guinness most. Records, you know, records of any one person. Okay, very good. Uh, Pedro has. Pedro Less has what? Fewer. All right, fewer. Right, fewer medals than Enrique. Very good. All right, I'm actually gonna ask everybody here, guys. Okay, um, Maylin, give me the next one. Uh, number four, Mandarin Chinese has about 500 million. Four. What? More. More. More native speakers than English does. Okay, good job. All right, number five. Saturn has from 500 to 1,000 rings. Your, um, Uranus has 11 rings. And Jupiter, Jupiter has four. Jupiter has... As what? As fewer. Jupiter the has the fewest, right? Because you're comparing more, three or more things, guys, okay? The fewest rings, okay? Very good. Uh, Mars has two moons. It has blah, 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 moons, then Neptune, which has 13. This is a comparison between, how many things are we comparing here? Two. Two, right? So what are we going to use here? Fewer. Okay. You were very good. All right, good job. Uh, the Spanish word, the Spanish word with blah blah blah. Uh, it has twenty four letters and is a type of medical worker. Okay, so the Spanish word with few most more. Okay, with the most the most. most. Okay, yeah. right? Because you're comparing guys one Spanish word versus maybe like. 50,000 more words, got it? Estás comparando una palabra con todas las palabras que existen en español, guys, got it? All right, so this is telling you, hey, esa es la palabra más larga que existe en español. Got it? De todas las palabras, esa es la palabra más larga en español, guys. Okay? All right. Uh, the next one. Number eight. What is the answer for number eight? More. Okay, the most. guys, it says Thailand exports, Thailand exports, actually, it's just a Thailand exports, right? I don't know why it says exports. Th Thailand exports about 9 million tons of rice a year. Oh. Vietnam exports about 4.6 million tons. And India exports about 4.5 million tons. 
So how many things are we comparing here? Three. Three, Three right? Three. So the most. we're not so the we're most. gonna use a superlative, right? The most, okay? Rise of the three. Very good. Next one. Um last one, Egypt gets only zero point two inches of rain a year. It gets blah blah inches of rain of any inhabited city. It gets the fewest inches of rain of any in a mm -hmm. city. Mm -hmm. Why fewest, guys? Can we count? Can we count rain? Can we count rain, guys? No. No. Less. Right. It has to be singular, right? Less. The least, least inches of rain, right? The least, okay? The least. Okay, very good. Uh, number 10. The Hawaiian alphabet has 14 letters. It has? More. More. More, more letters than Rod Rodriguez, which has 11 letters, okay? And that's it, guys, okay? Good job, all right? Very good. Guys, keep practicing with these exercises so you understand, you know, because I see you're having some doubts, guys, but so you understand, guys, keep practicing with this exercise and try to ask yourself, hey, why is it like this, you know? Por qué es de esta manera, all right? All right. Now, is this clear, guys, now? More or a less? A little bit. A little bit? All right. We have to move on, though. So, uh, but you have more exercises, guys, in, on, on the platform. Remember, guys, for this week, guys, you need to have finished section one, two, three, and the midterm, okay? All right? Okay. So, before tomorrow, guys, you need to have finished that, okay? Any questions, guys? Anything that you, that you need? Good. Thank you. Thank you. All right. If you want to if you wanna know more about this topic, guys, you can watch the class on YouTube, okay? All right. You can rewatch the class if there is something that you that we missed here. Got it? Okay. All right. All right. Very good. Guys, thank you very much, guys. Thank you for coming. I'll see you tomorrow. Take care, guys. Yeah. See you. Bye.